regardless. Wrestling Observer Live here, seven days a week. We are always here with you. Jay uh, had a, a question on the other end, and Jay, I, for as long as your question was, I can give you a very, very short answer to this, and that is, as far as stockholders go, no, there is no answer for Vince McMahon. As far as the general market goes, no. There's going to be a stock drop no matter what when it comes to Vince. There's going to be a, a sad feeling that goes over because Vince has been there forever <laughs> because it's his company, and it was his dad's company, and his dad and his dad's dad was a promoter before that, and on, on goes down the line, and we don't know what the answer is. We'll have to find out what it is. Triple H is that guy. Stephanie is that woman. They are Stephanie for regardless of what you think about her as a presence on television, as far as any of that sort of stuff. She is not stupid and she is very well connected. She has a good business mind. She has seemingly stayed out of the creative end of things because of her father and Triple H and other people that are, that are there to handle that. And this is just bigger than who takes over with Triple H. It's who he has around him. And look, when you look at some of the names that are there, and I know Kevin Owens, as an example, isn't going to be there forever, but obviously, you know, Triple H is always like Kevin Owens. And you have Adam Pierce, who was there for, you know, who's been there for a long time now. You had Pat Buck. You have guys that were furloughed that could come back who could serve in different ways. Your landstorms and guys like that. And you think about the experience level of all of those people. And you think about the wrestling minds of all of those people. And you think about how some of those people were revered on the indie scene. Your Steve Carinos, your people like that, that you possibly could have at your disposal there. You know, it's going to take a team effort to move things forward. And we'll have to see how it goes. Um, now, Triple H being a great promoter, but not sure about a great mind. I mean, look, no offense, and this is not an insult to Triple H, but you can be a great promoter when you have the biggest safety net in the world to fall back on and probably the, the greatest vanity project of all time. I mean, that whole thing was was set up and ready to go and again i'm not i'm not trying to demean him here but like taking over wwe is going to be a different step and regardless of what you think about your your vinces and and bob uh, arams and don kings and, and people like that i mean they are giant presences that it's a lot more than what's just inside their mind it's their presence it's their experience it's a lot of the the small things the detailed things that you can't teach you know that that he has and those guys have for their business but